How's it going everybody? Welcome back to another video. I'm super excited because we were just on a two week break. Now we are back at our local backyard show. We're here at the Westgate show. It's gonna be a two day show. Today is Saturday. We're gonna be set up next to Jack from Dorcasaurus Cards. He hasn't quite got here yet, but I'm super excited. We have a bunch of deals lined up already. We have people who have already ordered cards. We have people who are coming in to sell us a bunch of stuff. I'm expecting over 50,000 in bulk today, plus a bunch of cards and slabs. I'm super excited to get this day started. Let's see how day one of the show goes. All right, you guys always want to see our setup. So here is the setup. We have two tables and we have new display cases. So if you guys remember, we used to have a wooden case. My wife really did not like it because it took up so much trunk space. We ordered two of these uh, kind of like school board bulletin boards and now we're able to fit three of them instead of just two. First case is most to be mostly of our high-end stuff. This is stuff that's usually going to be in our eBay page. So if you like anything here, if it's available, it should be on our eBay store. These last two cases will have cheaper stuff or stuff that we recently got in and haven't had a chance to list online yet. So we got some loose packs here as well, some older stuff. The last case just has some very cheap slabs, mostly Japanese for the most part. And then on the very bottom, we have some raw singles. We do have our binders. We have the mid-tier binder. This is everything from $5 to $25. This binder and this binder, which is from $2 to $5. And anything in these first two binders are a dollar each. And then as you guys know, we have the infamous buy station uh, where all of the cashing people out or trading them up all day. And then we have our sign and we have some ETBs here. Morning. Not too bad. How about yourself? Are you set up today? Did you do Burbank this year? No, I didn't. I've never done Burbank. I feel like for Pokemon, especially after the last time, I've heard it wasn't too great. I feel like they're transitioning into probably starting to become a up and up now. My wife was like, I think we really should just try it. Yeah. Like for me, it's like a financial thing. Like the tables are really expensive and like I have to pay for yeah. us to go out there. She got to take time off. But she's like, I feel like uh, we should just, you know, we should just try it one time. And if it doesn't do well, then we don't do it anymore. I'm like, all right, so. Overhead costs yeah. and everything. And like I said, so it's like, if you only have 10 grand in inventory, it's very unlikely you're going to make it. sell everything. Yeah. <laughs> I think a lot, a lot of people, they like the idea of it, but like when you actually do the numbers behind it, they don't, they just don't think about it. And I'm just like, that's the things I'm thinking about. Is this financially worth it? Because otherwise I'll just set up at a local show or just enjoy the weekend off. So we were considering it just because we want to walk it. Thing is that we're in LA next weekend and then we're back in San Diego the following weekend. That's a lot of travel. Awesome. Thank you so much. All right, well, good luck today, man. Thank you. Take care. Have a great weekend, man. PGA EX. If I did, I would only have three more. Let me double check. I have one more. You want that? Yeah, that's all I have, unfortunately. Eight, nine, 10, 11. You want to find another dollar card and do it for 10? There were a bunch of people who talked to us on Instagram. Which one were you? And uh, how much did you have? I said 14,000, but I have 15. Okay, then you are fine. There was someone who said like, I have 50,000 and I told them tomorrow. We're expecting 100,000 and I couldn't take another 50. So like, you are fine. The other person is not fine. What yeah. are you doing with all the balls? We do a bunch of things with it. So we sort through it. We build master sets. We do have someone who buys it from us for pretty much the same price. And we also have other people who are looking for bulk that we can kind of make a little bit of money on it. We do a bunch of things with it. Just not one simple thing. There you go, boss. There you go. Oh, let me get you something. There you go, boss. Have a good weekend, man. Give me one second, boss. There you go, man. Here's your daily treat. All right, do you have a count for this? Are you looking for cash or trade? 150 bucks in trade value. All right, Suey. Whenever you're all set, just let me know. What's the maximum you guys take? Per day. It depends. Like if we're at a show, we can take up to like a hundred thousand. We drive a car. Yeah. We don't have like an SUV or anything like that. Oh. We've taken over a hundred thousand before, but I like to keep it at a hundred thousand because I don't know what else I'm buying that day. An ETB, you fill it up like this. It's about five twenty-five. All these boxes we don't need. That's why we brought the empty five rows is because it's a lot easier to pack it in the car. Because oh. we bump people off for trade anyways, so like yeah. you're getting free value. It kind of works out. You're all set, man. Thank you. Twenty-seven in cash or cool. forty in trade. Cool. All yours, man. Appreciate you. Uh-huh. Anytime, man. Good luck today, man. Yeah, thank you. It's just about 10 o'clock right now. The show hasn't even opened yet. We are completely set up, but we've already taken in 20,000 bulk already. I'm trying to get it organized into these the five rows already, so it doesn't take that much space. Looks like it's going to be a very busy day, guys. Let's see how it goes. My wife just got back from Target. Whenever we at the show, like her first stop after we set up is to go to Target. And she got me something. 
Not that I don't need it, I'm not complaining, but uh, a mega block Squirtle, I can't complain about that. If you guys want to see me build this in a video, let me know in the comments. I'm not even going to ask how much that was. 5,350, 245, 250, 380, and 36. And I told you 63 cash or 96 in trade. Definitely trade. Yeah, I can, I can price it out. Uh, give you 20 in trade more. A nice 120 in trade value. Whenever you're all set, just let me or my wife know we'll take care of you. Thank you, man. So if it's in a clear sleeve, it's because the condition so you can see it. If it's in a like a sleeve like this, where you can't see it, it's near mint. That's kind of how we do things. It makes it nice and easy for you. And if you want to take it out of the sleeve, feel free to. Can I help you with something, boss? I brought some gold. Okay. 2200. 40, 40 okay. All right, so Nate, it'd be 29 cash with 16 trade, or it's going to be 62 total trade. And then whenever you're all set, just let my wife know she'll take care of you. $90, baby girl. This is Anthony. This is my oh. old high school classmate. Anthony, this is my wife, Jazzy. Old boy one of these days. It might be a bit, but one of these days. Thank you, man. Have a good weekend, boss. I know I was supposed to help. Dango. What's going on, man? What can I help you with? Are you looking for a cash or trade? Uh, trade. Okay, let me get you pricing. How's it going, boss? Can I help you with anything? Trade in. I need to do this first. I'll help you, all right? $27 total. Or if you wanted trade, it'd be 31 in trade. 20, 25, 67. There you go, man. Thank you. Thank you. We took care of you? Thank you so much. Have a great weekend, guys. Just want to calculate the discount for you. That's why it took forever. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, I have something for you. Hold on one second. Here you go. Thank you. Uh -huh. I appreciate it. No problem. Oh, hi. How are you? Good. How are you? Here's another one for you when you're ready with that. Thank you. Uh huh. 142, make it a 160 in trade value. Does that work for you? Did you check this already? Oh, the Rika. <laughs> How's it going? Jacob, I was messaging you on Facebook, but the seal Pokemon. Do you mind if I just start bringing it over? Yeah, yeah. If you can put it like right here, it'd be fine. Uh, I have a dolly. Is that fine? Is that good? Yeah, and yeah, then you yeah. have this too? 250 minus the 160 in trade. 90 bucks. Thanks for stopping by, man. Always a pleasure to do business with you. Thank you so much, man. All right, man. What can I help you with? CGC. I can give you three on trade on each of these. We wouldn't pay you in cash for them. No, 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 no. Three each. Hey, sorry. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, okay. Hell yeah, I'll do that. I'll yeah. do 21 for all that. One, two, three. All right, three, let me see what else. I'll do the trading because I need yeah. a couple cards. What was your name? James. James. Yeah, Jack said to come see you. I guess he's known you for a bit. Yeah. Is that your old, old buddy? We met here at the show. We partner up. He actually takes care of the tables for us. So. Yeah, I hang out with Jack a lot at the shop. And... All right, James, whenever you're all ready, just let my wife know. You got right, $21 in trade value. Excellent. Right. Thank you very much. No problem. I'm gonna check that, make sure everything's in there. And then you had bulk, six, 23 cash, 37 trade. Four dollars, right? Four. You would have 33 in trade value if you want trade value. Yeah, I'll do that. 33 in trade value left. All right, whenever you're all set, just let my wife know. No problem, man, any time. 4,500 commons on commons, then 500 of just hollows, reverse hollows, or rares. Yes. Are you looking for a cash or trade? Uh, trade. So you're at 62 in trade value for just this. No problem, anytime. Love your videos. Thank you, man. I appreciate you watching. Can you work with Jacob to verify everything on this list is what we're buying? You know how reverse hollows now, they're like hollow uh, here? Outside, yeah. This is the reverse hollow back then. Also, the difference between what on eBay is that whatnot, you have to constantly be able to be on live in order to sell things, which is a time commitment. If you're not live, then you're not going to sell anything, yeah. right? For me on eBay is that I can put in a couple hours every single day and then just have it up on our store. And then if people buy it, then they buy it. So if I'm on vacation, I can still make money because it's still being sold. Yeah. But like if I'm on vacation and I don't stream live, then I don't make any money. Do you sell on TCG Player? We do not. You can't sell slabs on TCG Player. It just doesn't make sense. I have taxes for this and I have taxes for this and I have to worry about inventory for both. Yeah, yeah. I like to just streamline it all in one, one spot. I already have a well-established eBay account, so it doesn't make sense for me trying to create a new account when I'm already doing like really well on one platform. Just for logistically, if I sell an item on TCG Player, then I have to go to this another program to create a label, and then I have to upload that data into here in order to yeah. get in their tracking information but on ebay i can just do everything all in one screen on ebay we do higher volumes my time is limited i mean it takes long enough already to ship on ebay to add another step it's just not worth our time enough all right so these are cash prices if you want trading prices would be maybe higher but yeah, i have to add good. everything up 58 in cash and give you 65 in trade you'd be at a total of 127 in trade all right brian you're all set just let us know and then we'll uh, take care of you all right thank you
Thank you so much, man. Appreciate it. Thank you for watching, too. I appreciate yeah, you guys watching. I've been binging a lot of the older ones, the older show ones. <laughs> Thank you. Can I help you with something, boss? Uh, as soon as we're done with this major deal, I'll be able to help you, all right? Sorry, there's a bit of a line. Yeah. Was there anything I could help you with, boss? I'm helping him, then I have to help him, then I can get to you, all right? Big fan by the way, man. Good work. Thank you, man. I appreciate yeah. you watching. We do have some more. Um, we have a couple duplicates. Not a lot. <laughs> I appreciate your patience. Of course, man. I wish I was that good. I'm not. <laughs> the older cards are more of a pain, especially if they're raw, because yeah. the conditions are super dependent. Yeah. How are you today? I'm doing good, man. Yeah, I made a weekend trip with the girlfriend, so I fiance. Okay, where are you so, coming out of from? Uh, we're from Sacramento. Oh, Jesus, you yeah. drove all the way out here. Yeah. Low drive, but we liked it, man. I'm a teacher. Okay. We had all week off, so we were like, let's just get a little day trip out of this. So the school system gives us a whole week off. Really? Day. You guys deserve it. it would be 39 20. Let me know when you get a boss. It says I sent it. Let me know when you confirm it. Okay. Yeah, we're all good. Thank you. Thank you, man. Thank you so much. It's hot over there. Yeah, no, I was just People are like, uh, you can take a look at the pricing okay. and whatever you're comfortable. So the first okay. price is cash, okay. the second price is trade. I can take a look. I'll look at everything. Everything, yeah. everything cool. Because we, we buy everything. Cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 22 cash, 25 trade okay. for this stuff. If yeah. I put this, that'd be 70? Yeah. So I'll do that and then I'll get the two for 70 over there if that's okay. Okay. And then what did you want? Crown Zenith, Astral Radiance, Fusion Strike, both Scarlet Violets, a Paldean. I'd say the better value is Crown Zenith. The whole Galarian Gallery. Yeah. Like some of them will have chase cards, but the Galarian Gallery is okay. more like stable. Yeah. It's two for so, so it mix and match. Oh, yeah. okay, so I'll get one crown. So Astral Radiance is not a very good set to open. Okay. Paradox Rift has all the Rowing Moons in it. Okay. Fusion Strike has the Gengar VMAX. That one. That's a you wanna do that one? Yeah. Best of luck to you on yeah, those. You, Let me clear this out and then I'll cash yeah. you out. Yeah. And you said you wanted cash on these stuff 192 120 40 60 80 90 91 92 perfect man appreciate it there you go man hey man that was an honor doing business with you i appreciate you coming by and your patience in, yeah. man appreciate it thank, thank you. you so much appreciate it thank you thank you for watching like i said of course, man oh yeah every time i see the notification come up oh, i gotta tune in i hope you can enjoy the rest of your of vacation course, man. man thank you have, have a one. safe drive back you too. i'll see you guys again thank you all right, your next boss. Sorry about that. 53 cash or 82 trade? Did you want cash or trade? I'll probably do the cash. 20, 40, 50, 1, 2, and 3. All right, thank All right. you so much. Thank Appreciate you for your patience, man. Else, yeah. thank, thank you, man. Thank you for watching. Yeah. No one's next. You're next. 33 cash or 51 in trade? Let me take a video. Whenever you're all set, just let her know. All right, what can I help you with? Trying to sell some singles? Yeah, I'll take a look. 60 cash. I can give you 70 in trade value. I'll give you a little bit more. Whenever you're all set, just let my wife know. She'll take care of you, all right? Look at a whole car full. Is that everything? And then this whole box is Watsy. Watsy bulk? Yeah. It's just double. You want cash or trade? Trade. 185 trade. All right, Brennan, you're all set, man. Right, just talk to the wife whenever you're all ready. Good seeing you again, man. All right, thank you. How's it going, man? Good, How's it going, Manny? How are you? Is this your little one? Oh my gosh! So adorable. You have 70 cash or 120 in trade value. Did I price that Lorcana stuff for you yet? Did you want everything? 137. Uh, you owe me 15 bucks. It's like 17, but like 15 is fine, man. All right, Manny. Good best of luck to you in two weeks, man. We'll talk afterwards. Best of luck tomorrow, too. Take care, man. All right, what can I help you with? J, seven vivid voltage, two cash, three trade, 1.5, 2.5. So for this stuff, it's 40 cash or 64 in trade. Did you want cash or trade on all of this? You guys are up to like 207 cash, 260 in trade. I'll take the cash. Okay, 207. We work with contracts. I'm EPS. Uh, <laughs> well now, well now, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> One, two, five, six, seven. That's a lot of Alright man. Appreciate it. No problem. Yeah, Alright boss, give me like 30 seconds. All right, boss, what can I help you with? Do you have a count on this? Or is it just commons, uncommons? Cash or trade for all this? I'm doing cash. Okay, 30 cash for your bulk. I'm the biggest bulk buyer in the Bay Area. No one does it bigger than I do. I went around, I walked to all the tables and I saw bulk here. I was like, what? <laughs> you found us. No stores um, buy it. Thanks, Danny. No problem, man. Good seeing you again. Hopefully we'll see you in a couple months. Take care, man.
Is there anything I can help you with? Should I sell some stuff? It's gonna be a minute. Can you guys wait? I always tell people like, if you want the most for your money, just sell it online. But people's like, well, I don't got time for that. I was like, well, then that's where I come in. <laughs> I, I got time. I had a very expensive collection, but then I needed money to get her ring. So I just cashed everything out. And I realized at the end of the day, this is all just cardboard. I could really use the money to put it to a good place. After once I realized that the collections are just money, I'm like, why do I need to collect anymore? I mean, technically I own these cards, right? Until yeah. someone buys it. I could take a photo, I can put it on Instagram and I, I have it memories. I don't need to keep it. What good is like a first edition Charizard in the PSA 9? It's just sitting there. I can look at it or I can put that money into work and like buy something with it. That's, that's what I, I don't know. I, maybe I think weird. To each their own. You're not the first person to, to say, can you cash me out so I can go on vacation? Well, I don't want to sell all this myself. So we're community based and I know that's very uh, loose term and people like to throw it around. Our cards are intended for the little one. So I know not having allowance means in Silicon Valley, but there are some kids that can't afford it still. For them to buy a booster pack for $5 and not get anything kind of sucks. But for $5, you can buy five cards that you really want in our binders. I think that's more important to me. Rather give back to the community because, I mean, the community will take care of you in the end, right? That's how we live by. We try to make it affordable for folks. Almost done, boss. It's just I have to give you the right prices, sorry. I'm going as fast as I can. Very busy. I got a mess to clean up. You can't even see it under the table. There is a pile of cards and boxes. It is just a massive What's amount of cards. Event? Can't beat our prices. I challenge people. Always sell them. We're always the cheapest on the floor. People tend to think I'm trying to sell them something. I'm like, oh, he's the cheapest. I'm like, no, I really challenge you. I like, go ahead and walk. Come back. We'll be here. And then I ask them when they come back. I was like, was it? And they're like, oh yeah, you were the cheaper. I played competitively Magic, and then I moved over to Pokemon. Two tournament finishes away from Worlds, and then COVID hit. During COVID, I transitioned from playing to the business side. Because I've been selling on eBay for years. During COVID, an opportunity presented itself. If I really try, then I can make a significant amount of money. Someone says I can do it, so. <laughs> when she says no is when I have to stop. We have a YouTube channel too, and it, it's growing. Food vlogging is great because you get to eat and film content at the same time. I like, can't beat that. Kinda, what do you do for your YouTube? Smile, you're on camera. <laughs> the camera's actually set up right there. Oh, cool. Yeah, this is the content that we do. People love to see us buy and, and sell. Film what I love doing, like this is great. Community really supports us. We give a lot of the, the young ones free cards. They don't even have to buy anything. You just stop by, we'll just give them free cards. So this is for the binder, all these numbers. Let me just add this up. 756 for this binder. You did all that work, I would say no. <laughs> You'd be surprised. People have done that. They've, they've wasted hours of my time. They're like, yeah, I thought it'd be more. You buy graded? We do. You buy everything. That's why people come to us, because it's like a one-stop shop. People are like, oh, you just buy things for like that price and you just resell it. You know how many hours I spend sorting cards? Like just the bondage itself will take a whole week to take everything out and sort everything. Yeah, you make a little bit of money, but like I don't think people can sacrifice that many hours just to get ready for a show every week. I, I do it because I enjoy it, but not the average person can't do that. I don't like live stream because I have a feeling that I'm going to say something I'm not supposed to say. I'm going to get canceled. <laughs> I feel that I'm not good in front of the camera fits my business model to just work on eBay and not worry about live streaming. $63 on this stuff. Shake your hands. <laughs> <laughs> Camera in the sky. You keep really good care of your cards. I appreciate that. You'd be surprised how many people will walk up and like they'll hand me a Charizard without a sleeve. They're like, how much do you pay for that? All the heat. We're not kidding. Are we there yet? Yeah, you're already past far digit. So this is where we're at right now. We hit the 1500. Not quite. Is that the magic number you're trying to get to? That's my plane ticket already. Yeah, it is. <laughs> That's some people's vacation, not gonna lie. You're at 1494. I'll just bump you to 1500. Might be cleaning us out of cash. All right, we're gonna count this together. The best lunch break ever. There's five, there's the other five, and there's the last five. As they do in the casino. All right, man. Josh, by the way. Danny. Danny. Nice, nice to meet you, man. Jazzy. Jazzy. Thank you. We just paid for his uh, vacation to Philippines. Uh, yeah. <laughs> this, is my, this is my ticket right here. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I'll be much easier. <laughs> Give me like one minute. I am aware. So we're out of cash cash. I wasn't expecting that. That was a walk up. All right, what can I help you with? I appreciate your patience. 4,000, 20 bucks. I pay you 10 bucks for this. I don't really want that. Pokemon Go is just really bad product line for some reason. I think I have to hold on to it for a while. Danny, you guys have a good one. Thank you. 
You too, man. Have a good vacation. If someone were to ask me what to grade with, I would say for Pokemon, it'd always be strongly recommend PSA because the collectors will always want a PSA. For ultra high end, maybe BGS. Personally, I would never grade with CGC. The only time I would grade with CGC is for the error card because they're the only ones that actually take in the notation of the error. 95, 110. Be aware that if you want cash, we have no more cash. 10, 20, 30, 35, 36, 7, 8. All right, Ronnie, so you're a good for 526 cash or 600 in trade value. And then whenever you're all set, just let my wife know. Thank you. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Thank you for your patience. Yeah, no problem. Can you do me a favor? Can you stop buying? No. All right, boss. What can I help you with? I'm the guy for the um, Crystal Golem. Dave, JD. Me, yes. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Let me grab it real quick. And the Magic Carp too, right? Yes. I have you for 200 right now. Carp for 50 and then the Golem for 150. Yeah, 80 trade. Okay, cool. Is that an even cross? That's pretty much even. That worked out very well. <laughs> Thank you for your patience, man. Thank you, sir. Thank you. That was very quick and easy. I know. <laughs> How's it going, guys? How are you? Not too bad. What can I help you guys with? Some bulk and some binder. So we watch your channel, so it's nice. Thank you guys for watching. All right, so for the bulk, you're at 110 cash or 178 in trade for just the bulk. Okay. What would you like to sell? Because we'll buy everything. The first number is cash, the second number is trade. Don't sell anything that you don't want to sell. Yeah. So this right here is 107 cash or 126 in trade. Now, whenever you guys are all set, just let my wife know. All right, what can I help you with, boss? 1,400 commons on commons. $42 in trade value. Cool. All right, son, let my wife know. Thank you. We are just starting to buy it. Uh, no Padan face Chinese, right? No. We are just starting to buy it like two weeks ago, so yeah. we haven't taken that much in. Prices have finally come down as we can see like in the Iono. Yeah. Which just proves my point. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> Tommy, how are you? What can I help you with? Uh, this is 20 bucks right here. How's it going, man? How are you? Doing good. Take care, man. I'll see you next time. So I want to value this at 300 in LP. What percent do you want me to pay on it? This would be probably great, so we'd probably give you like 70% on it. 210. Are you okay with that? I'm okay with it. I appreciate you. Most of the stuff that went to grading, I can admit that none of it graded super high, but we weren't expecting that. You're the second person who came with a Dark Dawn fan today. I've never seen this card before today, and now I've seen two of them today. <laughs> <We're lost. laughs> I didn't even know a Dark Dawn fan existed. I'm willing to work with you. We've, we've done a lot of deals. You can say no, I don't take any offense. Yeah, I'll hold on to this for now. You're good, man. 344 total. Let me know when you get it, boss. Yep, just got it. Thank All you right. so much. Thanks as always. Easy, quick transaction. Appreciate you, Tommy. Yeah. Take care, man. Have a great weekend, good. guys. I'm gonna admit that we might not be here in two months because that's the same weekend as the Vegas show. All right, what can I help you with? 277 cash, 428 in trade. Whenever you're all set, let my wife know. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Have a good weekend, man. How's it going? Good, good. You see, you so tired? You can't see what's behind the table right now. If you just look underneath, <laughs> there's just massive amounts of cards. Oh, so 8,000 total. We have JJ over here. He gave us Pokemon stickers, like old school ones. And we're going to go give them out to kids. Thank you so much, JJ. No Hopefully it lets me pay. Awesome. You get it? Yep. Chris. Danny. Chris, by the way. My wife. <laughs> Hi. Yeah. There you go. Here you go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Have a good one, Danny. Have a great show tomorrow, guys. Thank you. you, miss. Have a problem. Cutting you off. For you, 170 trade value. You have a lot or is it not too, okay, not too much? Okay, yeah. Uh, eight cash, 10 trade. 180. Yeah. Matthew, right? You're good, man. I'll help a little bit. <laughs> Thank you so much. You guys help me out. I got you. All right, man. Have a good week if I don't see you. Do you guys want to put it on the table somewhere so you don't have to hold it? For this stuff, we're taking for a total of 255 in trade, plus 170. You can take a look at comps, but I don't think there's anything recent. We're currently the lowest price on eBay. I always undercut That's the market. We do it for like 50 bucks, bro. Okay. Just for you, man. It's, it's, it's smoke. Honestly, like, I'd rather get the smaller stuff than the bigger stuff. I heard it. We should be good, bro. Appreciate it, brother. Good seeing you again, man. Thank you. All right, guys, what can I help you with? Full one of this is 525. Okay, that's fine. 75 cash, 85 trade value. And then whenever you're all ready, just let my wife know. No problem. Thank you for your patience, guys. All right, what can I help you with, you guys? Do you have a count on everything? In the bulk, you're at a total of 74 cash or 116 in trade for just the bulk. 87 cash or 131 in trade. 
Uh, what was your name? I'm Nicole. Nicole. And whenever you guys are all set, just let my wife know. Sounds good. Thank you. How's it going, man? Pretty good. How's it? Not too bad. Busy. You can't see behind the table, but if you could, it is not pretty. I am still, I haven't got to you yet, bro. Sorry. Um, you're, you're happening right now as soon as I clear this. Hey, can you do me a favor? Can you stop buying? That'd be appreciated if you could stop buying because I don't know what we're going to do with all this stuff. 45 or 50 in trade. Yeah, we are really running on fumes. 20, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. There you go, man. All right, man. Good luck tomorrow. Thank you. I did enough today. I'm just like... We have zero cash. We've, we've bought so much that someone took all of our cash. Oh gosh. Yeah. Literally like two bucks. Yeah. yeah. Can I borrow 87 bucks? Daddy. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. This is your backyard. Uh -huh. <laughs> Six, seven. No problem. Have a great day, you too. Thank you. I played competitively during the uh, team up Unbroken Bonds era. Yeah, we had cases of Unbroken Bonds. We just ripped them, like, whatever. There's a magic carp. He's hopping out of the water. It's just like this fat Pikachu, just like, ah! Wanna check it out now. <laughs> you're flying, magic carp, you're flying! You're doing it! It's the white moment. I'm closed now. What's another 100 or 1,000, right? This is one box? This is one box. Okay. Eight cash, 13 trade. We normally give people discounts anyways, right? Yeah. If it's like a higher ended item, the listing price, like the sticker price on it is exactly what I would sell it on eBay. So all I'm doing is I'm subtracting eBay's cut out of it and passing the discount on to you. And I take the cash up front because I don't gotta list it and I don't gotta pay for the shipping or anything like that. So I save on shipping, you get a cheaper price and it kind of incentivizes you to buy. That makes sense. Yeah. People don't like to think that way. If I gave you like $30 off, would you buy it? Probably, yeah. I saw your video on YouTube sometimes. Oh, thank you, thank you. Oh, I don't want CGC either. But it's Charizard stuff. We don't pay that strong for CGC. It's a five for 155, so I think that 200 is a little off. Take care, guys. Don't study too hard, man. Yeah, of course. People want the ponchos in like high grades because they're only going to buy it once and that's it. We had a BGS 9 and people didn't even want it. They want like the 9.5 or a 10. Because you're going to spend that much money on a poncho, you might as well get the one that you want because they're not going to do it again. Well, we have a bunch of shows. We're not going to be in the area though. Like next week when we're in LA. There are people who have cracked out like $300 cards and resubmitted them. Like there's a PSA 9. Crack it out and like they'll get a 10. I cracked out a PSA 9 and it came back at 8 and I said I'm done. That, that, there is the game of that, right? Hey, what's up guys? Danny for the day. Danny 2.0. Got your collection with you? I'll buy you out right now. No deal. <laughs> but I'll buy your collection. Danny's gonna put this in what? <laughs> he probably would. That will move followers to your channel. 44. $40. You can give this to your friend and then this is for you. I watch you guys' YouTube video. Oh, thank you for the support. Uh, you this is across. for you. And this is for you. Uh-huh. Here you go. Thank you. You're welcome. This is for you. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, guys, it is about 5.30. We kind of cut halfway through the show just because the camera died. It was extremely busy for us. We were buying pretty much the whole show. Everybody who said they were gonna come by and drop off some bulk and sell us some cards ended up doing that. I would say we're definitely well over 100,000 in bulk today. Uh, just a crazy amount of buying. People want to get cashed out. Not a lot of buying per se. A lot of people were looking just to trade cards. I understand the economy is a little tough right now. More than happy to give people a trading credit. Bunch of new inventory that we're gonna be able to put up on our eBay store. Tonight, we're gonna go home, have some hot pot because my wife is starving, and then we have to reprice everything and get ready for tomorrow's show. We will be back here, although there is another show nearby. Thank you to everyone who stopped by and said hi and made deals with us. Also, thank you to everyone who said they watched our content. Like I said, we are super blessed that we have the community behind us and supporting our channel. Thank you guys so much. Till tomorrow, stay safe, stay healthy, and see you guys in the next video.